James Corden is set to return to the UK after reportedly turning down an eight-figure bonus from bosses in LA to continue presenting the Late Late Show stateside. He and wife Julia are leaving California after an eight-year stint to spend more time with family in the UK, although tattle mean he no longer lives in the vicinity of Prince Harry. He seems to have built up a close friendship with him, and the actor and presenter even received a message from the prince in the midst of an interview with The Sun. Despite that, he wasn't at all keen to dive into the current royal debate with the interviewer, insisting, it's not fair. Instead, he playfully taunted of the texts, Oh God, wouldn't you just love to see these? Harry has been splashed all over the headlines due to the news that his wife Meghan Markle will not be attending King Charles III's coronation next month, instead remaining in California to celebrate their son Archie's fourth birthday. Jameis' diplomatic silence on the Harry row comes in spite of the fact that the star, who will bid farewell to the USA after 1200 Late Late Show episodes, poked fun at him on screen earlier this year. In Harry's ITV interview with Tom Bradby, he insisted that only four lines of his memoir Spare were allocated to the story of him losing his virginity. On his own talk show, James jokingly fired back, Only four lines, that's okay, it happens to a lot of guys the first time. He then teased, In a field behind a pub, that's one of those things that's worse than the sum of its parts. You lose your virginity in a field or in a pub. Not great either way. Along with the joke. Now, despite admitting that every aspect of his stateside life has been a picnic, James is set to return to home soil. He nostalgically spoke of his experiences to the sun, exclaiming, Even if tonight's show is my last day in employment anywhere, ever again, I have had an incredible run. I co-wrote and co-created a show, Gavin and Stacy, that is loved in my own country. I am so proud of that achievement. He added that the only L.A. habit hell be bringing home with him is a penchant for meditation. 